Hey guys, here we are again uh, with another class build for War of the Roses. Um, so far, oh jeez, he's been relatively quick. Okay, I got that kill. Um, and as you can see, this is my speed sword build, uh, a two-hand sword um, with full light armor. It's by no means tanky like my uh, other builds that I've released but it is a bit of fun and we quite often use this this light armor build with, um, for anything in Trolling Tuesday. How did I get hit then? Is there a bit of lag in the server, is there? Looked like he hadn't even swung yet. But again, you can be in and out, like I just did 40 or 50 damage to that guy there. Straight out, quick bandage. And uh, on with the show. Now, our target is medium armors. Um, medium and light armors, because basically, pff, I mean, we just basically, we wreck anything that is uh, below medium armor, or below heavy armor, because the sword will swing. Now, there we go, I've just bled that guy in one hit. We'll see if we can get this guy up. Good, good. Whoa, hey. Whoa, hey buddy. Hey buddy. As you can see, you've sort of got to be, be a bit careful of... There we go. Get out of there. Because these guys hate you once they see what you're doing to them. Oh! Come on, get some speed up. That's it. So as you can see, you can sort of get in and out of combat without getting... God, one guy's chasing me here. So, right, so at least we get a bit of uh, bit of speed up, bit of run time. Now, it's not going to be anything that you can actually do as a permanent permanent solution to anything. I mean, plate armor wearers um, are going to do tremendous damage to you because you can't really do much damage other than a stab. So anyone with plate armor and the same sort of build is, is all they're going to have to do is block down. However, that's the sort of damage you can do there. You just run in, take a quick shot. I call this one the cherry picker build. Now we can get in, like I just did 20, 30, 40 damage to that guy. Just help him, make him bleed, help the teammates out. Oh, idiot teammates, I tell ya. Oops, hit my own teammate there. <laughs> As I'm saying, idiot teammates. Oh. That was bad. You want to get away from the action. Give yourself a little bandage up. You can only take one or two hits, so you're a bit of a glass cannon. But it's a bit of fun. A bit of fun. <laughs> it's just good to get in. Oh, here we go. So we're chasing medium armor, guys. There we go, get in, take the kill, get out, sprint away. Hopefully a teammate gets hold of you. Do a bit of a... No, no one chasing me. Do a bit of a heal up. And we're back in the action. So that's how the speed build works. Um, you cannot tank stuff. Oop. There, I went in for the stab against heavy arm. You're much better fighting in twos and threes. Um, and I know that sounds a bit stupid because any build should be better, but this one really complements because as they're fighting, you can come in and get a really cheap hit while they're um, there. And you can also come in and just clean up archers. Oh god, that was not a good move. So we better just watch ourselves. Oh, I like that. There's a few archers. Don't want to lose their speed. Just, we're just doing a lot of running around here. Actually, in position is doing a very similar thing. Um, so you've just got to be a bit careful here. See, so we want to stay away. There we go. Just a quick 27 damage. There we go. Just in out. There we go. Quick kill. 
Okay. Am I gonna try and take this guy? No. I may get may get killed here, but we'll see. There we go. So this is the sort of thing we want to be doing a little bit more of. This guy. Try and save him. Yep, I got the kill. Oh, just got roll by my teammate. Come on, dude. Won't let me bandage him because he doesn't know how to play the game. That's fine. <laughs> this guy's got an arrow sticking out of the top of his head. So, you can do a lot of damage. There we go, insta-kill. Now, every time you swing at somebody, I know you'll see me bandage a lot, but that's because this class just takes so much damage from anything. You need to be at 100 health nearly the whole time. So now, I could get in there and try and take those archers down. But in order to do that, I may go the long way. Oh, here we go. There we go. So there's one kill. I mean, this does... In a team deathmatch, obviously, it's not as big of a, big of a deal. But, um... Oh, come on, get in there. That hurt. I need to get out of there because I actually really missed time two or three of those stabs. So we don't want any of this death business. Because in team deathmatch it's all about kill death ratio because you must be having at least two to one in order to have an impact on the game. Yeah. 